Now that we've generated the solution, we can begin to interpret the results according to the F FDA submission guidelines. So the first thing is recoil percentage. And we can see that we have a max deformation uh, 0.32132 millimeters. And then at the most collapsed balloon point, we see that the stent has a value of 0.29928 millimeters. So there is recoil there. We can also evaluate the peak stress as measured in the equivalent stress by retrieving the result at time equals 1. And we see we have a stress of 265.38 megapascals. Similarly, we can also find the residual stress at time equals 2 at the most relaxed state by right-clicking and retrieving result.